Morning, Wastelanders. Wanderer here. Welcome back to Fallout 4 Horizon. We're back at home plate. I have come back and uh, done the, well, sleeping and such back here. Uh, I want to check on production storage and do this whole thing here. We're getting a good amount of workshop supplies and various trash. This comes from, I think, salvaging stations, maybe, or maybe the technician scrapping stations. Um, but it's just kind of assorted stuff. Um, it's nothing really crazy. I don't see any adhesive in here or anything, so nothing great there. We are getting fertilizer, though, as well, as well as some crude oil, which is good. We'll take all that stuff. We'll take everything from our command mission menu. Nothing here. I must have already gotten that. Let's, uh, go back and check our mailbox. Nothing new here. Okay. That's all good, then. Let's dump stuff in here. Check our experimentation lab. Make sure we don't have any new unlocks here that we can do. Maybe. There we go. Okay, reverse engineer. Nothing new. Okay, that's fine. Okay, let's see what we have as far as the ammo. Double everything in here to see what we've got. Um... I got a lot of 10 mil and a small amount of 45 rounds, quite a few junk shells for 12 gauge, and some 5.56, five, and uh, that's about it. I have a lot of fusion cells too. I'm kind of saving these though for whenever I can make, um, whenever I can make these into, uh, whatchamacallums, 2 mil two mil vice cartridges. That'll be kind of nice. So, in terms of weapons, what does that mean? What do we have here that we can use? I'm not a fan of the basic fusion cell, laser pistol anymore, laser rifle anymore. It's just not that great. So it means we've got basically our plasma, which we can make more plasma rounds if we need to. I don't really have I don't really have much in the in the way of three five seven or four 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 or uh, forty four do I? I have zero three five seven and only a couple of forty four. Okay, so we can probably drop off the pistol for now. This thing we do have a decent amount of forty five rounds for. Did I have any thirty eight rounds? A couple. Okay, so we'll do some forty five rounds. Maybe some forty five cryo. Can use the SMG a bit. The three oh eight stuff is always good. No 50 cal for that. No, it doesn't look like it. That's fine. Um, probably put this thing aside for now. So LMG and SMG. And that's kind of about it, except for this thing. Now, I could um, spec this thing out. Is it worth it for 180 10 mil rounds? I mean, how much damage does it do with 10 mil? That's the question. So I got this decent R5A automatic pistol, which they are fun to use. Uh, it's just a question of whether or not it's worth it for the ammo. Oh, this only uses 5 mil now. I thought this used 9 mil and 10 mil before. Huh. So the 10 mil is only usable in the 10 mil now. That's new. Um, it's only going to be plus one per upgrade, right? Yeah, kind of a lot of adhesive to spend on this thing just to use up my 5 mil rounds. I'll probably just scrap my 5 mil and sell this thing then. Making more plasma is always an option. Let me see here. Weapons and ammo. Could turn my 45 rounds into 45 cryo rounds. That'd be a decent use of my cryogenic fuel. Asbestos, I don't know what else that's used for, so that'd be fine. I could make some 45 rounds, too. Like, that's a reasonable gun if I use 45 ammo in it. The, um... The SMG is. Plasma cartridges? Yeah, we'll probably make a good amount of these. I can make, a uh, 200-ish. Yeah, around 200 of these. Yeah, that's good. Four of those will be good. That's uh, 160 of those total. It's not bad. 
And then we'll do some 45 cryo, because why not? I wonder if that gives us science skill too, since it's a science based recipe. Recipe Doesn't seem to be. No, it's just gunsmithing. Well, hey, at least we're getting gunsmithing skill. That's nice. Okay, so there's 45 cryo. Hope I didn't screw myself there with making that into 45 cryo. Um, anything else I want to make here? It's enough to go out with. It's fine. What about scrapping and such? I don't have the points yet to, to scrap my, um... My explosive stuff, do I? My nuka... Where the hell is it? My nuke, yeah. 40 explosives. It'd be worth it to do that, to get all the nuclear material and energy cells and stuff. I do have three points to spend right now. Survival's an option. Scrapping, I don't really need. Uh, science, we gotta wait till next level. Chemistry is good too, but... I have to wait till like level 20 to really make good use of it. I'd like to get my workshop tech level a bit higher. Which would require me to have a decent way to do that. Like I can't really... I don't have any good recipes for that right now. I guess I can do investing in science here. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go ahead and do science for this then. The fiber optics is kind of rough, but I got some, so that's fine. What's that push us up to now? 4.2. Okay, we're at 4. That's good. 4 is good. That's all the standard training sessions we have, though. I do have a bunch of advanced ones. I just don't have anything I can do with with um, science. That's either engineering or chemistry. And I don't have um, the skill points yet for it is the problem. All I really have is... I've got commerce, which I could do, but I don't want to spend all of these. I can do it all at once, so I kind of want to wait until I can do it all at once and do technology and just get my technology pumped up as fast as I can to get pretty much infinite purified water. That'll be really, really helpful. Okay, that's where we are with that then. Because we need tech level 9 for purifier modules. And that's all that's really stopping us. I mean, tungsten carbide's pretty rare, but I could make two of these right now, which means I would increase my daily allotment of uh, purified water by two. I'd have two coming in every day. It'd be really nice, so... Fiber optics from this, huh? I don't think we need that for anything. We do need these for, like, one thing later on, but I think, uh... It's fine, we can scrap them for now. Sensor module. Yeah, go ahead. That's all good stuff. Um, Do I go ahead and invest in some explosives so we can scrap our main nukes and make more ammo? I think we do. One mortal demo expert. There's only one point. I think that's fair. I think we maybe hold on to the rest for now. Until we know exactly what we need. I think we're going to probably need to go into either science skill or robotics for engineering skill. But even for robotics, I mean, I wouldn't have enough, I don't think. What's my engineering skill at right now? Let me check. Field kit and check our skills menu. So my engineering is 38. I need 120 to uh, cap out. So I need to get basically 100 points. I need to get like five points worth of engineering to actually use that somewhere, which I can't do for a while yet. Like engineering is... Um, that's only on... Yeah, we get a little bit from this, and then we get a little bit from... We get quite a bit from Robotics Expert, but again... I'd have to get to level 25, I think, to get this. I think we're better off doing uh, 
chemistry, just like maxing that out. Or maybe science, I'm not sure. Whichever one. But yeah, we really can't do that right now, so it's fine. Okay, well, none of those really help me all that much right now, so I'm not going to worry about them too much. We're just going to refund these points. I wouldn't have gone into locksmith too if I wouldn't if I realized I wouldn't have had to. You only have to you only have to do one, I think. You can just leave locksmithing at zero. We can bump up blacksmithing some more. Oh yeah, I should do this so we can repair our power armor, yeah? Well I still wouldn't be able to do X01 though, but I would be able to get T60 at the very least. Plus doing some more um advanced stuff, right? How big of a deal is that right now? I think I can already pair uh, T51 stuff, which I don't think I'm supposed to be able to, but I certainly can. So it's not a huge deal just yet. All this stuff is in pretty good shape, too. Uh, I think we just go with um, Explosives Expert, so we can start scrapping main nukes. Or, we, already, we already did that, right? We already got that, so we don't need another one. Okay, so then... Uh, can I craft any... If I can make some fusion, or not fusion, um, pulse grenades. That's quite a bit of science skill to make that, though. And if I could make pulse grenades, I could get the vice gauze rifle, but that's not going to be happening for a while, apparently, because it requires 90 explosives. I don't want to invest that much into explosives. So my best bet's probably the Brotherhood for that. Maybe Cricket? I can try stepping outside and see if I can find Cricket. Yeah, we can try that. At the very least, though, I can now disassemble Mainukes and Missiles, which means we get lots of good stuff from those. Yeah, lots of nuclear material and fusion casings, which means we can make fusion cores if I need to, and energy cells. Almost enough energy cells for one round of plasma per Mainuk. That's a pretty good deal. These have phosphorus in them as well, which is great. I think you're pretty pretty sure you have to have phosphorus for making API uh, rounds. Pretty good. What are frag mines? Just explosive material? Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, uh, so we can make a few more plasma then... And we'll have to call that good. Quite a few more plasma, actually, yeah. Okay, that we're actually- we're- oh my god, we're one short. Okay, look, I can make one more round if I scrap, like, one bullet. One stinking bullet and I can make some more- another craft here. What are we gonna- let's do 30 WP. That stuff is no good. And let's do, um... I don't think I can do the 12-gauge junk rounds. Just the 12-gauge regular ones I can do. That's unfortunate. Probably all I want to scrap then, to be honest. But that should be enough, right? I should have to exit here first and then go back in and I can make one more round. No wrong thing. Exit. Weapons and ammo. And then check for plasma. And yes, we can do one more round of plasma. Cool, and then we used up all of our energy and smokeless powder. That's one reason I like the plasma. So yeah, nice. Alright, that's cool, and then... Excuse me. Then we'll see if I can do, um... Any more upgrades here. That is ever so slightly... More damage. Wait, no it's not. Never mind. Okay, we're not doing that one. We can't do this one yet. The higher science is required and more nuclear material. Cannot do any of these yet, unfortunately. This is just like... No, it's better recoil as well. Um... Is it worth investing this now? Because I have to spend the resources? Well, we'll see what else is available. I don't have a large magazine yet either. Already got the reflex site. No augments. We can't 
use anything except for plasma right now. We don't have any recipes except for plasma right now. Heavy plasma looks like it's uh, quite a bit better. The downside of heavy plasma and why I don't like to use it is because it takes a long time to travel. It doesn't go as fast. And it's, um, or at least it, it used to. I'm not sure if that's still... Yeah, so this, this has increased projectile speed. This one does not. It's the old style plasma, which like... That's fine for up close, but it's going to really suck for long range. Um, I do think it's worth getting a better stock for this. We're going to be using it a ton. Go ahead and do that. Can put this thing away. Uh, this thing... I could make some upgrades here, but I'm not going to just yet. I think I have... Did I have something better I could use? This thing we don't have a whole lot for just yet. I could upgrade this, though. Yeah, I don't see why not. Could do a full stock as well for... Uh, a lot better recoil is the best, best... The big thing here. A lot of adhesive used, though. Drum magazine would be nice. I do like my drum mags. What can I say? Compensator for better recoil. It already has a little recoil. I'll just wait till I can get a suppressor or something on it. That's This is all fine, as is. That's all I think I'm going to do for that. Okay, so we got the hunting rifle for long range. Alright, so we got... We got our number one on here. We got our number two on here. Just use this thing up when we can. Number three for our... You know, mostly used uh, stuff. Number four for this, and then number five. Wait, yeah, right, number five for that. No point in taking the R5A out right now. Okay, I think I'm good with that. Um, nothing else I can really make use of here at the moment. I do have these APX rounds, I guess. I could maybe find a use for those in the uh, light machine gun, but I doubt I'll need them for anything. Okay, dropping stuff off. Making sure we drop anything extra from here. Oh, well, that should be fine. These can just all go in for, here, for now. I should have enough... Yeah, we got enough stuff I can last for a couple more days looks like i'm yeah that we got plenty of kebabs and stuff we should be good we'll sell some of this stuff in order to make some money back should probably go and plant some of these tatoes and stuff and mute fruit and such at various settlements and various areas i guess i could just do it here Can I also put a doctor thing down? I guess I don't need to because we're in the middle of Diamond City, though, so it's not really... It doesn't really matter. Okay, I'd say we're good. Um, Gotta heal. Gotta eat. One more, and sanitized water. Still thirsty, eh? Okay, I think we're good now. Alright, we're heading out. Sorry for spending so long on this. People requested I go through this stuff. Uh, so I... Don't like to always skip it. I'm roaming with my own. Oh, did I not bind my SMG to two? I guess it was on four. Okay, so that's two. That's three. Let's do this be three. Have this be four. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Use up those 38 rounds. Five, five, six rounds. Lots of plasma. Sniping. 
in one of those. Okay, cool. Oh, I forgot. Um, that's what I'm forgetting. Chems and cures and healing and such. Um, we got plenty of first aid supplies. I'm low on right away. That's the main thing, really. I might try to go without any more right away, though, for a while. Yeah, we gotta go out to Simon City because we gotta go and get ourselves healed up at the doctor and then sell some stuff. I'm trying to hold off on using the melons that I have for right away because I want to save them up so I can plant more. That would be ideal. Nothing to see here. I have only one antibiotic. These are really cheap, huh? I guess I'll buy some. Yeah, that's fine. And then what can I sell to you? The one thing I don't like about home plate is there's no music and it's like rough for narrating. I guess I don't realize it until I'm out here, but there's yeah, there's no music in there. Well, at least we're getting our money back, I suppose, from that, but we're going to lose a bunch of money here. Doc, radiation poisoning is a common ail... Yeah, take a look. Tell me your symptoms. Just... Uh. Okay, we're good. Done. Hard caps, not too bad. Alright, I guess we can head out now. We're responsible for that new coat of green. And where do we want to go? on the wall. Oh, the wine poster again? Looks nice. Andrew Station, huh? Protection for sale. Okay, so we got a bunch of places we can go to over here. All right, I have to help Paul Pembroke intimidate Henry Cook. So, off-screen, he was pieces. he talked to me between episodes. Hey, who wants to look I guess we can do that real quick. I think if we just go in there and stand there in our power armor, it should do the trick, yeah? Until, um... You need something, Scaver? Paul shoots at him. I'll meet you there, then. Don't be late. Yeah, yeah, I'll be there. I just have to close up. We need to talk. Jesus, Paul. What now? It's time for you to shut up and listen, Cook. What the hell is this? And what are you doing here? Don't tell me he's hired you to help lean on me. That's right. You should listen to what Paul has to say. You're making a mistake getting mixed up in this. Well, I'm listening, Paul. What do you have to say this time? Just this. You leave Darcy alone, starting now or else. Now that is a very bad idea. You don't want to pull a gun on me unless you intend to use it. But you think I won't use it? Huh? Do I just need to kill you? Is that what you're saying? Don't, don't do it. Paul, put the gun away. Nobody needs to get shot here. There's no way this works out in your favor if you pull that trigger. No, screw, th here we go. Whoa. They both die? Oh, I'm sorry, Piper. I, I don't know what to say. I, I didn't kill this guy. Well, that sucks. I, I didn't... Like, I think that's because of Horizon's damage scaling and stuff. Like, that's why they died. Okay. Was that Paul's note? Is that what it said? Um, Cook's note. Cook will use a spot near Baxter to Peril since I'm bringing a double shipment of chems like you wanted. Make sure Nelson Latimer brings enough money this time plus what you owe from last time. Morowski's not going to put up with that bullshit again, Trish. 
ambush the chem deal and kill everyone. Now look, that was not my fault. Hey, ain't no shame in taking the occasional cap. Solomon can hook you up. Maybe I should have just let them kill each other. I wonder if Paul Pembroke, like, if he lives. I don't know how that works out. I mean, I didn't touch Henry Cook, but I think I'll still get the quest for what's her name for his daughter. She'll come in and want to talk to me and won't believe me. Okay. Uh, I don't want to go to the west. I guess we'll go north and do this uh, chem deal real quick. I could go over the west and check out the... The... Uh, baseball stuff, yeah. Been a really interesting week. We had a lot of news with... Um, the two companies that have B and G and S in their names, uh, Battlestate Games and, of course, Bethesda Softworks. Uh, or Bethesda Game Studios and Battlestate Games. Yeah, those, those are the two. Anyway, it was an interesting week. Um, they both kind of did bad. Um, we had Battlestate Games, makers of Escape from Tarkov, doing what we all wanted for so long, which is making a PvE mode for us to play, but it's a watered-down, crappy version. Dogs should spawn here when I do this, by the way. It's a watered-down, crappy version. I think. Maybe not. Usually I spawn. Eh, yeah, whatever. It's a watered-down, crappy version of, um... The single player Tarkov mod, which I play and enjoy quite a bit. And maybe it's over here. I can carry something. What's that noise? Noise? Let's do this. Hope I didn't hit him. We good? We're good. So yeah, that all went pretty badly. They made a paid version of that. And if you're an Edge of Darkness owner, which should include all DLC, as per the words on their website, should include all future DLC, you can get access to this new PvE mode, even though by all rights you really should. And not only that, but it was a $100 upgrade from the Edge of Darkness edition, which was already like 120 bucks. They're asking for 150 bucks for the full version of Tarkov now, which is just robbery. It's just such crazy greedery. It's really bad. They backtracked on that a little bit, and now they're saying, oh, well, Edge of Darkness owners, you can get the uh, PvE version for free uh, for six months. So you get it for six months, and after that, you can't play it anymore. And it's probably just going to be like six months from now, and then after that, you're just SOL. This is the place we're supposed to go. Sure you saw something? Out of bullets. Time to swap. Uh, what am I using here? Weapon kit, right? I'm gonna go to 45 cryo rounds. Fancy, fancy. Feel that? It's called fear. 
Boom, boom, baby. Hey. Ah! 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 Come to that that kind of hurt. He was a legendary though. That's kind of nice. We got some good stuff. Bethesda, of course, just put out the patch, the next-gen patch, next-gen update or whatever, which just caused a bunch of problems. I have not updated, obviously. I won't update for quite a while, it seems like, because it just isn't going to be worth it, and yeah, just bad idea to update right now. Other way, Wandy. This way. There you go. Do I have any throwable explosives here? Unfortunately not. There's a spot. Uh, unfortunately, I can't... Um, maybe I can. I don't know. Can I buy the chems? I think we're better off just killing everybody, right? This is set on... I didn't realize this was set this on uh, single fire. I mean, it's not terrible as single fire. It's not sure I want to do it like that. send anyone after me. I'll tell Moroski it was gunners, okay? You can trust me. And uh, uh, I'll give up Moroski's chem lab. This here? <laughs> this is nothing compared to what he's got stashed there. What's at this chem lab? More chems than you can imagine. Moroski's entire stash. But you'll never find it without my help. You've got a deal. Okay. I guess I have to trust you. The lab is in the old Forley fish packing plant, on the waterfront in South Boston. What's so secure about that? The place is overrun with feral ghouls, which don't even look twice at my crew, because they're all ghouls like me. My idea, by the way. I assume there's more to it than getting past the ferals. You assume right. The real security is a system of tripwires that have to be triggered in exactly the right order to open the door to the lab. You never even know the lab was there when the door is closed. So how do I get in without hitting all the tripwires? With a password, which I can give you. There's a terminal that will bypass the tripwires and open the door to the lab. So I have your promise, right? If I give you the password, you let me walk? And you promised to not tell Morowski that I had anything to do with this? Screw you. I already gave you more than enough. I'm out of here. I mean, that was a real bad move. Even have you lost your mind? What could they have possibly done? <laughs> I was going to say, even Piper doesn't care, but uh, apparently she does. Okay, well, Piper didn't like that too much. Are we still okay, Piper? You were really liking me before. Hey. Shoot. Piper, 
You know, I still really appreciate the fact that you're not an idiot. Uh, thanks? I guess? No, I, I didn't mean like... <laughs> I could just use some help. This isn't the sort of thing I'd normally bother anyone else with, but you just seem really good with people, and I've got this issue with my sister, Nat, becoming me. Becoming you? What do you mean? I'm just terrified she's going to start taking up like her big sis. I mean, think about the life we lead. No offense intended, Blue, but... Personal safety doesn't exactly seem like either of our strong suits. I can't have her ending up like her big sister. Dodging bullets and running from all the people she pisses off. It's part of the reason I'm on the road so much. Part of the reason I'm here with you. I keep thinking, maybe if I make myself scarce, if I'm not around her enough, she'll cool off. She'll just go back to being sweet, innocent Nat. Paper girl, an all-around upstanding citizen. What do I do, Blue? You don't stay alive in the wasteland being a sweet, innocent little paper girl. I think it's the, the wrong move. She needs you to be there for her. You just love her. Family's precious. The last thing you want to do is drive them away. Because you might lose them forever. You're right. I can't risk that. Thanks, Blue. Who'd expect wandering off with a stranger to turn out this well? They really don't make them like you anymore. <laughs> You're a hell of a friend, you know that? The feeling's mutual, Piper. Ain't that the truth. But hey, thanks again for listening. It's a real weight off my chest to be able to talk it out with someone. So, you want to hit the road? No flirting because this Wandy is big, dumb, and ugly. We have zero charisma. When I didn't get a um, a warning from Piper what with the uh, conversation thing there, like, I guess she's upset with you pretty much no matter what, unless you um, can talk Trish down there, which kind of sucks. Like, I mean, what are you supposed to do if you can't pass that speech check? Piper's just upset with you. Nice. Okay. Also nice. This used to be nerfed really, really, I mean, it still is nerfed really badly, but it's a lot better than it was. Hey, see here's somebody. Blue, we're not alone here. Found ya! Didn't know when to quit, did they? The cryo thing's kind of nice. It sort of marks them for me. Thought I heard somebody. Forty-five rounds with this thing does pretty good, even as a single shot, it's pretty good. Good enough damage a two shot with the chest on most enemies or one shot with the head. Not bad at all. Okay, so with that done, we can head uh I guess we can go west and check this out. Although we're gonna be going west soon anyway. We gotta go over eventually and uh talk to we'll go and find nick to the east over here do i want to venture over there already i guess we can i have plenty of ammo and healing supplies and such we ought to be okay for a decently long excursion out to the east there it'll be fine what could go wrong We're not going to get there today, obviously, because we're going to be clearing as we go, but hey, sure, we can clear stuff out along the way. Have I been through here yet? thought I was through here already, but... Yeah, we were here. Okay, yeah, we were, we were already went through here. 
Piper's reaction was so violent there, I was worried that she was going to get pissed off. But yeah, Bethesda kind of screwed the pooch with this next-gen update thing. Um, I wouldn't... If you haven't updated, I wouldn't, I wouldn't bother. You're going to end up being disappointed and upset because you're going to have problems. Buggy and crashing and missing textures... And I guess all the stuff that's available there is still available on the uh, Creation Club anyway, so it's not really anything new. I am detecting enemies tracking your position. Thank you, Subnautica Lady. Let's get this over with, shall we? Hey, space to harvest is no longer space. Ours hey, now. we got some actual stuff there. Alright, and we got some people here. Oh, right, this place. I recall this place. I bet I can't scrap those things. Those things are worth a bunch of salvage. At some point, Wilson will be able to tag cars for me too, and he'll just salvage them for me, so I can just like run through an area and have him salvage stuff. That'll be cool. No more car salvaging. But for now, you salvage everything except for big trucks, because trucks bug out and freeze us up. Holy Mission Congregation. I actually recorded about two hours of a survival playthrough, a regular survival playthrough. Thinking that, um... Thinking that I would do like an updated survival mode, best start type of guide sort of thing. Then I crashed and lost uh, the first two hours of progress of it. Like, not a playthrough or anything, just like, uh, you know, how to get a good start in regular survival mode without Horizon or anything for the people that are just coming into Fallout 4 for the first time. But yeah, then the game crashed, and I was like, well... Not gonna bother anymore. Such a pain. It's ironic, but I mean, the game really does run a lot better with the mods I have on it that it does just in villain, you know, regular survival mode. I think Horizon fixes quite a few bugs, and there are a bunch of other bugs that are fixed by various other mods I have. You gotta be joking. Nope, I wasn't joking. I bet I can get over that. Oh, come on. Hey. I can get over it from going over here. Don't know if I really need to. I need to check the um the patches channel in Horizon Discord too and see if anyone's done any patches for anything that might improve the performance in Boston a bit. Didn't used to be so laggy, but I'm pretty sure we were using the Gone. more advanced version of Previs bin before. Pepper, oh, you should have come with me.
You okay down there? Apparently not. Sheesh. This is like a ramp almost. Uh, I can't make it over there from here. It's too far away. Not unless I had a jetpack. I don't think anyway. Well, I, I did make it inside though, which is what matters, I suppose. That works. Wait, was it just open? There's just a door there. Okay. Well, don't I feel dumb now. Who's there? Did you just fall down? Did you get frozen? Never mind. I thought by the animation there she fell down from getting frozen. That can happen with enough shots. So wait, where is the other guy I shot? I guess he fell down. That's where he went. Okay, I'd say that's that. Keep on going. And try and salvage something from these dogs. Apparently if you want meat, you kind of have to use the uh, bolter now for these guys. I don't like that change. I don't... It seems weird that bullets just automatically make the meat unusable. I could see the torso thing, maybe. But if you get a shot in the heart, it doesn't do anything. It's only if you, like, hit the stomach that it makes the meat unusable, you know? Even then, like, my first buck that I got, um, I got him with a gut shot. I was aiming for the heart, but I was not quite on, so I got him with a gut shot. And then finished him off with the headshot with the uh, shotgun slugs. And his guts were pretty messed up, I mean... You know, they were, like, bulging out of his body. It was it was pretty disgusting. Pretty... Pretty bad. But, I mean... The stomach wasn't punctured, and as long as the stomach isn't punctured, you're good, I'm pretty sure. We didn't have any issues getting the meat from him. What's that? Nice try! <laughs> oh, are we, uh, melee? And Vanilla, this is always a um, missile launcher, a super mutant. They just got a random weapon in Horizon. Much easier to deal with. I kind of want to just go ahead and get Nick and rush the main quest a little bit so we can get the Brotherhood here. Because I want... Oh my god, the FPS really is bad. Sorry, guys. Um, because I want to rush the Brotherhood getting here so that I can then get some pulse grenades, because they're the only ones I think that will sell me pulse grenades. Bad idea. That was better than expected. Nothing. Oh, no, we got something. We're good. Ow. Sorry, Piper. You got you got damage from it, too. Well, you all ready for a bit of murdering over here at this cult? Huh, that bird had mass. It actually stopped me from walking forward for a second, I think. Usually they don't. Excuse me. Here to learn about our movement? 
You're part of a movement? That's right, friend. It's changed my life. And it can change yours. Talk to Brother Andrew. He'll be more than happy to give you all the details. They've all got that, uh, pencil, thin mustache. They all have it? I think they all do. Hey. Welcome, neighbor. We're always glad to see a new face around here. Tell me something. You ever feel like this whole world is broken? Do you ever wonder why things can't be the way they were in the good old days? I've got more important things to worry about. I doubt that, neighbor. What could be more important than transforming your life, and maybe the whole world along with it? We call ourselves the Pillars of the Community. We're a pretty new movement, so you may not have heard of us. But we're growing fast all across the Commonwealth, and you can be part of this exciting future. Step right this way, and I'll be happy to tell you all about our movement and how you can be a part of it. I don't want whatever you're selling. I'm not selling anything, neighbor. I'm giving away the secrets of long life, happiness, and prosperity. Giving them away. What do you say? Ready to take that first step into a new life? You owe it to yourself to give it a chance. Not a chance. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. I really can't take no for an answer, though. Once you find out all the benefits of being one of the pillars, I think you'll see where I'm coming from. Might Don't be, be shy. Just follow me. Wait, you're, always looking you're, for you're gonna things. force it on me? What happens if I kill him right now? Do I have to wait for his spiel, or can I just kill him? I'm always excited to welcome a new member into our fold. Don't worry. I don't bite. Alrighty. I hope you're as excited as I am. This is one of my favorite parts of the job, getting to welcome new members into our movement. The first step is simple. You have to learn to give up your attachment to material possessions in order to gain the ability to have true wealth, health, and happiness. Just go ahead and give me everything you own, and I'll initiate you as a first level pillar of the community. Uh, call me paranoid, but this screams trap. You must think I'm an idiot. Well, you came in here, didn't you? Now, you've got two choices. Give me everything you've got, or we take it anyway. You can't seriously think I'm handing over all my stuff. The world is full of suckers, pal. Just look outside. Every one of them handed over everything they owned in return for... <laughs> well, hope. Sure, it's false hope, but hey. It was worth it to them. You can tell yourself whatever you want, but you're leaving here naked or horizontal. Your choice. Can I just move out of here? I guess I have to do the threaten thing. I'm walking out of here. Your choice what you want to do about it. That's not how this works. Have it your way. <laughs> Paper. What if this is normal for other journalists? That'd be quite a story, Piper. It's just going to waste otherwise. Yeah, probably should heal up after that.
Should be a main in here too. A lot of this stuff counts as stealing, which I don't understand. Piper will get upset. Won't she? You get upset if I take this, Piper? Maybe not. No? Don't care? Maybe that was patched by one of the mods I have. That's kind of cool, though. Bunch of bobby pins. Nice. Good stuff here. Wilson will not take it because it's all marked as stealing. He won't take stuff that is stealing. That'd be OP. I guess this will preemptively get the um, quest for what's his name done too. For Jack Cabot. Since his sister is in here. Unless she's not here. God. I guess she's not here if you come here early. Okay. Fair enough, I suppose. Alright guys, I think I'm going to call it here for this episode. We'll continue exploring to the east, going into downtown next time. Thanks for watching.